Oh man, this hangover. Science! Where are you now that I need you most? Anthony here for DNews, and there is no real cure for a hangover. Seriously, there is not. But scientists are arguing that it's about time to find one. See, hangovers are estimated to cost US companies over $148 billion every year. How? Well, people taking sick days, making dumb mistakes because they're not feeling well, that sort of thing. We know a ton of stuff about the effects of alcohol on the body, but we've never looked much into the hangover, scientifically anyway. We know what it is about them that makes us feel awful. Alcohol dehydrates us, it increases the production of stomach acid, which makes us nauseous, it makes your blood sugar fall, which is where all that weakness and shakiness comes from. It also makes your blood vessels expand, which turns into that pounding headache. We even know what the main ingredient in alcohol is that causes all of these nasty symptoms. Congeners. Congeners are what give different alcohols their flavor, and there are more of them in dark liquors like bourbon and whiskey and dark beers. But so far, all the cures we have for hangovers are either folklore or con artistry or water. See, eating a greasy or fatty meal in the morning seems to be what most people do, which makes sense because alcohol saps your body of needed salts and proteins. Drinking fruit juice will give you back a bunch of your missing sugars and electrolytes and vitamins. Eggs are phenomenal for replacing cysteine, which is this super awesome chemical that your body uses to clean out toxins. So all this stuff puts a bunch of missing things back into your body, but you'll probably just feel bad again in 15 to 20 minutes because the damage is already done. So why don't we have a hangover pill? And no, the ones at the drugstore don't count because they are basically glorified multivitamins. Allison Mitchell, a professor at UC Davis, thinks that science shies away from curing the hangover because no one wants to promote out of control drinking. But she also says that a hangover is this interesting metabolic perfect storm of systems failing and that if we studied it, it would improve our understanding of the immune system, the metabolism, and our gastrointestinal system. Curing hangovers might just be the most important thing that science can do. Okay, I'm over-exaggerating. There is one major scientific advancement towards eliminating the hangover. Researchers at UCLA and USC basically got a bunch of mice drunk and then injected them with nanocapsules full of enzymes that the body uses to metabolize alcohol. The blood alcohol content in the mice began to fall super quickly. The thought is that in the future, you'd be able to have a few drinks, then take a pill that breaks down the alcohol before your liver has to, meaning your body doesn't have to use a ton of resources to break it down on its own. Boom, no hangovers. Until then, the best you can do is have a fatty meal before you go out drinking and then have a lot of water that night. Well, the actual best thing you can do is not drink, but I'm not your real mom, so I'm not gonna get all judgy on you or whatever. What's your favorite home hangover remedy? I always drink about a half a gallon of water before I go to bed and then eat all of the eggs in the morning. All of them. Let me know what you do and subscribe for more D News.